Remember the days of defining three mates to get a component locked into position? Well, with Autodesk Fusion 360, joints are used to assemble components. Initially, a joint locks down all degrees of freedom for a component with a rigid joint, but then degrees of freedom can be unlocked to allow assembly motion. Usually, one joint is required to assemble two components, which leads to faster assembly modeling. Fusion 360 animates the degrees of freedom that are being locked down. No longer do we have to go back and edit a bunch of mates to figure out which mate is over-defining my assembly. Also, limit mates are intuitively added to any moving joint with a simple right click and defining the min, max, and resting position. If components are designed in context of each other, they can be assembled using as-built joints. Click both components and select the joint origin and your model is assembled. As-built joints can quickly assemble imported assemblies too. Now click on the link in the top right to learn how to assemble your components together quicker with Fusion 360.